Hey guys, how are you doing today? I hope you're doing fine. Um, so I want to share a little bit about being slain in the spirit. Um, you know, that's when a um, woman of God or a man of God, um, you know, they're, they're, they're preaching and all of a sudden they might have a Holy Ghost encounter and fall backwards and go down and be out for a little bit. Nothing wrong with that. By the way, sometimes you can have an encounter and go down and it's actually a demon and uh, it needs to be cast out. But here's what's really important. You know, um, a lot of people, I guess they wish they had that anointing or whatever. They can just poof or go Phew! all that stuff and see people go down. That, you know, that's great. But here's, here's my concern, okay? Um, because I've been saved since I've been 26 and I'm now 64. So I've been slain in the spirit many a times and been, you know, on the ground and out. And, um, but that's not what changes you. It, falling down through the Holy Ghost is not what changes you, okay? It is asking God, it is surrendering to God and saying to the Lord, I surrender to you, Lord God. I surrender my life. I surrender my emotions. I, um, I, I surrender this. I surrender. I, I completely surrender to you, God. Use me. That's where you're going to start seeing the Holy Spirit working and operating in you, and you're going to see a, a great change in you. And it's, it's like a daily surrender. So when you see this, and maybe you've never gone down in the Holy Spirit, um, okay, it doesn't mean that, um, I don't know how to say it, but it doesn't mean that you're missing out. In, in other words, it's great, it's great to be slain in the spirit, okay? But that is not what changes your life, and I think people miss that. They think it's a great conference because everyone went down slain, but I'm gonna tell you, I know people who went down slain. I know them, and when I look at their lives now, they're not even walking in the Lord, okay? And that can happen. Why? Because they didn't give their life totally to the Lord. They didn't surrender everything to the Lord. And or they didn't get delivered in certain areas um, that were strongholds on them. That is what's important, is renouncing and being cleansed out. And like I said, giving all to the Lord. So I just want to share this. I feel like I have the right to share it walking 40 years. I'm not walking on water yet, but I'm just trying to share truth to you. Okay. Anyway, God bless you guys, and I'll catch you later.